Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Remake, Real Survival Mode, and, um, I did a little bit of stuff off camera, but I, I did not mean for this to happen, um, for some reason my video, it was, wasn't recording right, I mean, the dazzle wasn't recording right for some reason, so all you missed was me going, um, I went in here and I picked up what Wesker left us, he left us um, some handgun bullets and a first aid spray. I got that and I put it in the item box and then I got these mixed herbs and a few more ink ribbons from, let me show you real quick, let me show you where I got this stuff from. I got the mixed herbs, well actually it was a green and a red herb, I found them and I found some ink ribbons in this room right over here. But yeah, just thought I would tell you. That's all that you. Were, that's really all that you missed. And also, sorry for um on the last part there being no audio. I don't know why, but for some reason you couldn't hear my voice. But anyway, let's hope that doesn't happen. I'm sorry, but I'm kind of new to this um dazzle stuff. I'm not really used to recording like this because I used to use a camcorder. Okay, but anyways, now that's all settled, let's get some stuff because I didn't really I haven't really searched that room completely from where I stopped but it was, I searched um most of it but let's see see there's the mixed herbs I got here's the first aid spray that um Wesker left us and this is some of the ammo that Wesker left us okay um hmm let's see green herb we can keep all this here for now we need that. We don't need this. We don't need this. Or this. Okay. Reason why is because there's no enemies where we're going. And we need the small key to open one of the doors. I'll show you what I mean. Go right over and into here. Okay, so here's the room I went into. There was a red herb right here on the ground. And then over here, through that door, that leads to a little bedroom. And in there was a green herb and some, um, some ink ribbons. So now we need to go through here. Oh, I guess I've already used one of my small keys to go through here. Or old keys. Okay. There's a file right here. I haven't been in here yet. I can just pause and read this as usual. Okay, let's end of that. Now this room is a little puzzle room. Examine this, we take the fish hook, yes. Need that, this is a very simple puzzle. And over here you find this, we take the bee specimen, yes, we want that. And then, get the bee Lero over here. Yes, Lero of a bee. No, don't press that yet. So what we're going to do, since this one's a lure, we're going to use the fish up, combine it with that. Now all the lures go over here. Now since this bee is actually a real live bee, it's just a specimen, we're going to put it over here. Collection of insect specimens. Yes. Okay, the bad thing about this, when you open it up, um, and we try to take this, um, well you'll see. The bee comes to life. So I'm gonna grab this quickly and then run. We take the wind crest, yes. Now get out of here. No. Okay, he almost stung me. How's close? Okay. Oops. Let's go back to our item box now. Keep 
do. Okay. So that's everything in that little area. But now we need to um, go check some rooms that are on this side of the mansion, but they're downstairs instead of upstairs. So we've searched all the upstairs rooms so far that we can. So we're going to go downstairs now. Um, we're going to need the old key and the armor key, of course. And yeah, that's about it. Let's equip our handgun. For goodness sake. Okay. We're finally going to go through this door right here. Oh, I, f I forgot in this one that when you, in real survival mode, when you go through this door, it's not actually broken, so... Like, if we were playing on original mode, this door that I just went through, it would say you can only go through it twice before it breaks. So that's good. That's one good thing about real survival mode. Oh, great. Zombie just came in from that way. Crap. Uh, we're going through here. And that one. Oh, good. Discard the key. Yes, I go through. Close. Okay, this is another little puzzle room with crows. But just like the other crows, if you just don't shoot, they won't bother you. But if you get this puzzle wrong, then they will attack, so... Don't get the puzzle wrong, which... It's a very simple puzzle, actually. Lisa are protected by the three spirits. Picture of a woman wearing a bracelet, a necklace, and a crown. There's a switch at the bottom of the picture. Press it. No. See, her crown is green, her necklace is purple, and her bracelet is orange. So here it says, a valiant wearing a bracelet. The bracelet has to be orange. I'm not going to press this one. This one is the necklace. It's supposed to be purple. Here we go. This one's the crown. That one's supposed to be green. There we go. Right here, that's the crown. That one's green. That's good. Here's the necklace. That's purple. That's good. But this is supposed to be orange. So press it. It's orange. Now, if we go back on the other side, the first bracelet we saw should... Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to press that should be orange. And yes, it is. So now that that's all in sync and ready, we can press this. Yes, switch, press it. Okay. Yeah, if you did that puzzle wrong, the birds would have attacked. And right here, we get our second death mask. Pick it up, and yes, take it. Okay, and the reason I brought a small key is so we can open this. Yes. I only have one more old key. This leads out to the graveyard. Ooh. Um. Hmm. We need to get back to the item box. Which, the item box that we just used a while ago, but we're going to take the upstairs way because downstairs is crawling with zombies. So we're going to take the upstairs way. So I cleared everything out up here. Jeez. Oh, great. The zombie's trying to get into there. Well, let's just let him get in. I want to kill him. <laughs> I want the hallway to always be cleared out. Come on, zombie. Okay, we have nine bullets, so I should be able to kill him. Zombie. Hmm. Okay. Don't know what he is doing, but whatever, you know. 